What's up, YouTube? I'm Mr. No Name, or Max, as people know me in the real world, and today I'm bringing you guys a live singles match. Um, unfortunately, so far, I've had very bad luck today. I lost a singles match because it was a Blitz game, and I've never played singles Blitz before. I lost by one capture. Lost 31 XP for that. That was fun. Then I played an SMD against a guy that was 15 and 6. I lost that. I might actually use that to analyze and show you guys some of my mistakes. Um, I don't know how much I lost for that one yet, but now I'm playing this one. Hopefully I can win this one so that this can also be a gameplay that I can use here. But um, we'll just have to see how it goes, I guess. So off the rip here, I'm going to go over towards A, lay down an American doorway, and just stare at it. This is one of my more favored opening moves for Warhawk. I just like doing it. I don't know why. So at this point, he could be on flank, so I gotta be pushing up some. Um, he probably went B at this point, or he's on the flank towards A. I don't know. I'm gonna check his spawn here because sometimes people like to lay in the spawn. He wasn't there. He's honestly probably rotating to A right now, but I want to make 100% sure that he's not just lollygagging over here at B. So we are gonna check it. Alright, so I don't see anything. And this is just great. I can pretty much guarantee that he went A at this point. But, it's whatever. He seems to have a fear of planting the bomb. Okay, there we go. So, yeah, like I said, I kind of predicted it from the beginning there, but I just didn't listen to myself. That was almost really bad. My shot, like, my sh once I started shooting, it was good, but at the beginning there, like, my aim was way off of him. It took me a second to get it back on. So that would have been completely my fault if I had lost that. Like, that was honestly really, really, really bad aim at the beginning. Excellent job, team. Get ready for the next round. Switching sides. Alright, so the plan here is I'm going to run to mid-street, look at the trash can, and see what he's doing. Destroy the objective. See if he goes mid. He could beat me and get to a good spot to pick me, but... Okay, I've seen him up top. He's weak. I don't want to continue challenging, though, because I don't want to die. So I'm going to come up here and see if I can find him. And I got him really weak. He's not going to challenge that again, so I'm going to come over here and get the bomb down. Once I do this, I'm going to back up because I know what side of the map he's on and everything at this point. So we're just going to come over here. And we're going to look for him to come from somewhere. Okay. So, probably shouldn't have stayed in storage. I don't know why I did exactly. It's not a very good place to be. Um, you know, especially with knowing what side he's going to come from, because I don't think this guy is one that's going to go on the long flank routes, really. So, I should have known better, and honestly, I feel like my bullets should have killed him twice already that round, so it's not entirely my fault, but that last gunfight definitely was. So let's see if he goes B this time, like just right off the bat, which I'm assuming he did last time as well. Okay, those were some of the worst shots of my life. We lost that round, but we can still win this. I have no idea what was going on. Oh my god. I should have won that easily. Switching sides. I'm not too worried though. I I don't think I'm gonna lose this match because I don't see how I possibly could. Um this guy is not very good. Destroy the objective. I just need to calm down and focus. I'm letting my emotions get too much involved in this. 
Okay. So it seems that no matter how many times I shoot this guy, he just isn't going to die. Like, that's what it seems like. So. Time's almost up. I don't know where this guy went off to at this point. I, I really don't. But we are going to try something. We're going to go through Bakery and get over to A and see if I can get to a nifty little plant spot. I'm a little worried about doing it because it's somewhat risky, but I'm starting to feel like I might have to do so. Okay, so we're just going to plant it in this corner. And then we are going to try and run over to this truck. And okay, from here I should be able to see bomb. And I'm just going to stare at it and hope he doesn't see me. And there we go. Excellent job, team. Get ready for the next round. So yeah, that's a spot you guys can use. Most people don't check it or won't even see you because you blend in really, really well. Um, sometimes people will see you, but usually not. So it's just kind of a cheap spot to use to win around easily there. Um, this time we're going to go top bakery and I'm going to see if I can find this kid because I'm really mad that I haven't been getting some of these long range picks that I should have been getting. And I want to challenge it again and get the kill on him this time. Okay. It's all up to you now. Finish this. I haven't seen him. I didn't see him cross either. He probably went A. Yeah, I'm gonna say he went A. I'm gonna back up right now. Okay. So basically, if I would have kept going, I might have been able to survive that. Like, if I would have just kept pushing up on B. I probably would have wound up sitting in a corner and I could have killed this guy. Half time. That is so frustrating. Like, I absolutely hate that when that kind of thing happens. Whatever. So, we are going to push up on A here and see what we can do. He saw me, very obviously. Okay, he's still backed up like that. I don't know why. So I'm looking for him to challenge, maybe? He's not really doing so, though. Okay, I don't know where he went off to. Like, I really don't. The bomb has been planted. Now, he is around here somewhere. And I don't know where he went exactly. Okay, that'll work. Good timing for me for once. Finally, this game. <sighs> I need to stop planting the bomb though, because I've planted every time. So at this point, I need to just lay off of that and just kind of not do it anymore. Search and destroy. We are gonna push A though. Um, I'll give him a few seconds to push though. And there we go, got the kill easy round thank goodness excellent job team get ready for the next round yeah he's playing very very aggressively I'm actually gonna try something that may, may wind up being really really boring for you guys to watch and if it takes too long I'll probably fast forward this section what I'm basically gonna do here guys is I'm going to get an AR grab the bomb and I'm gonna come all the way back here and we're just gonna lay down and wait for him to 
peek a corner or something. And there we go. It didn't take too long, so I won't have to skip it. That's good. Um, some somewhat shaky shots, actually, though, from me. I'll let that recoil do too much to me. But it's all good. I probably shouldn't have actually shot, because he was still moving on my screen. But whatever, it worked. Um, okay. So, what am I going to do? I'm going to go this way. And, oh, I know. We're taking the slow way to watch mid. And get them through the window for the final kill cam. There you go, guys. So, as you guys can see, we're coming to the end of this video. If you enjoyed it, then please like, comment, and or subscribe. If you didn't, then let me know what I can do better next time. Constructive criticism goes a long way, guys. Until next time, everybody, peace out.